Hello, I am Rose and welcome to my channel, The Crafty Rose. Today's class is about making rope as an embellishment. My inspiration was this uh, layout, scrapbooking layout that I did for my son when he was little. He's over 30 now. And um, it's just this cord accent that I did here on the here like if it's um frame just hanging right so this tried to adapt this into cards so I have this card is the same concept of little swirls and then going all around and then happy birthday this could be a very good um happy birthday card for a masculine like a dad or a brother or husband a son it's um really nice as colors very neutral the other way that we can use the rope is as a frame go here twist twist and twist and then you just frame the sentiment and just leave this here or if you like you can put a bow here but like this is goes way with the frame and it's kind of more rustic look okay now I am going to teach you how to do this this black part is the one that I want to use here I'm going to do the rope designs in here away from the car so it's easy to handle um, here you can see here there are two pieces of cardstock you should use two pieces because we are piercing the paper and if it's just one ply of the cardstock it might get ripped so we are making the cardstock stronger by gluing it another um, piece of cardstock right so if it's going to go here so let's move the card for a moment here I am using this um, thread here my needle some of the red thread And I am using this cord. This cord is um, it would be called a macrame one, a macrame cord. And yes, I did a um, macrame decoration hand for the wall. I don't know if you guys want to um, have that class. I can make it for you. Just let me know. And I take a piece of the macrame cord and just. Now, 
bringing that in. We don't have to be um, very close together. The stitches, they're only there for decoration and to hold the piece of string in place. Okay? You see? Going all around. making the decoration secure okay now yeah. I will continue making the same kind of stitches until I go here so I am going to box and see you in a bit Welcome back. Now I finish all the stitches. As you may see, I'm going to do the last stitch here. Going all the way around, securing the cord. See on the back. Now I am going to finish it. The thread secure so I won't be undone. Let's go through one of the stitches going out and before the, the threads come completely tied you just put the needle between the loop and then when it's close it will create a knot and get the thread secure. I cut, put the needle safe here. Okay, now we have this stitch. I just put Then you just put it in the side. And there you have it. You just put your sentiment in here or here. And it would be also a great card for a masculine dad, husband, son, nephew, niece, anyone you want. Okay? That would be all for today's class thank you very much for spending this time with me if you have a question suggestions for a class or just to say hi please leave a comment below and if you like the content of this channel please consider subscribing and hitting the bell for notifications every time we post a new class thank you and may you have a great day and stay crafty